<clears throat> hey guys, and welcome back. Um, I didn't get chance at all today to do any extra work, and um, the new pre-patch for WoW came out, so I thought I might as well just have a, a relax of a day and just go through that for a couple of minutes. Um, and uh, yeah, uh, j let's just see see some of the new stuff that they've added. Um, so I'm just going to point out, this is one of the old models still that they haven't updated, um, which is the Blood Elf race. Um, there might be others, but I'm, I can't remember which ones. But just things to point out, so we've got very low detail hair, um, the ears are very thin, they're almost one plane it looks like for the ears. And you can see the same for the eyebrows, very, very thin up here as well. Um, so let's have a look and see. So we've got the, the new human models. You can see a lot more hand detail from the Blood Elf. The very square hands there, very round hands there, which is good. That look looks pretty good. Let's see, Orc. It's going to take a long time to load, it seems. The new Orc models look pretty good. Um, it looks like uh, things are still going to be textured onto the body of the of the character for chest pieces, but I will say that there's a lot more attention to detail as to where um, you know, necklines are and how shoulder pads, how rather straps are attached. So that's all looking pretty good. Again, the better finger detail as well. Um, the hair look, looks a lot better. So on and so forth. Dwarves. Um, this looks new too. The hair's still planes, but. I guess what what else are you gonna do when you have thousands of characters potentially in one spot at one time? Um, yeah, the dwarf dwarf looks good. Uh, new arms as well, nicely textured. Um, so that that's uh, that's that's pretty awesome. Oh, they do have new undead, which is cool. Uh, lots more detail in the bone structure. Um, the back looks a lot better than what what it was. Um, face models and hand details, which is really cool to see as well. Uh, Night Elf. I guess the ones that load slow probably be new. That's definitely new. So. So definitely better ears than the the blood elf. Um, uh, I guess they don't really need any detail with the feet. So the feet, uh, it looks like just the the toenails have been. I mean, the whole shape is different, but the only parts that come out now are the toenails. But the hands are all separate, which is cool. Um, yeah, this. This all looks really good. I'm excited to to play with all the new characters and everything. The Tauren, I assume the Tauren. Tauren's new. Wow, the hair, the uh, the hair on the top of the Taurens looks looks really good now. Um, Gnome, I wonder if they didn't, they probably would have done the gnome, I would assume. Yeah, it's taking a while to load. Oh yeah. New gnome character models. I'll, probably, I'll go through these a little quicker, because otherwise we won't be able to get into the game. Um, new troll, that looks really good actually. So the feet, feet look pretty similar, but the hands, hand models. New new skin 
texture as well. Well, obviously the whole character model's changed, but it's starting to fit in now with the uh, the Mist of Pan Pandaria models. So this is a, a Mist of Pandaria model, I'm pretty sure. Obviously, things like this, they're all all from Mist of Pandaria as well. So, so let's see, Drenai. Yep, that's definitely a new model as well. Um, you can basically tell if you if it's hard to tell the hands are a dead giveaway with the really good you know finger mo fingers that are modelled in now. Um, Worgen. I mean, Worgen weren't that old to begin with, but it does look a lot better. So I'm, I've never played a Worgen actually, so I don't really know, but I'm assuming that, that that's different, and definitely the human side as well. And Goblin. The Goblin, I guess, has, doesn't need to change. Um, it was a pretty good model to start with, and it doesn't look like this is a change. The feet are very plain, and the fingers are very pointy, and the hair's the old style. So I'm assuming that that's going to be going to be it. The panda's obviously going to be fine as well because um, panda's obviously the the newest. Uh, so let's just go back. Let's go into my character. one of the new screens for Draenor. Good tip. So the new patch has made things load a little slower. Um, yeah, some of the stuff here hasn't loaded. His new thrall model. He's gone bald for some reason, or maybe he already had. That's cool. And all the, all the, uh, car all the um, NPCs have had slight upgrades too I think or maybe they've just made new ones for this area because we're actually just outside the dark portal which is there um, but just before we start this quest just in case it's a cinematic um, if I don't know if you can still get it but if you signed up previously you can get this mount which is the uh, the American Choppers bike that they did for um, sort of like an in-house promotion uh, for Draenor and it looks pretty good and it has a really weird jump animation and it sounds alright too so that's pretty cool so I don't know if you can still get that you might be able to, to get it if you um, log on and subscribe to WoW before Draenor starts um, but check check that out um, just in case uh, let's start this Alright, I'm gonna fly. So what do we gotta do? Get some kill some grunts. Demolish destroyer. Actually let's just look at my character. So all the stats have changed as well. My health has dropped significantly. 
um, and my mana has two. Um, actually, yes. <laughs> so some of these things are now ten percent of the stats they used to be. Um, I'm pretty sure my stamina for this was like one or two thousand, and now it's a hundred and four. So um, a big stat change as well. Um, which I guess is good because it was getting kind of ridiculous. Um, so what do we have to do here? Demolish. Do we just click it? Let's just click it. Actually. A bit laggy. Oh, they have new animations for stuff too. That's sick. <laughs> Destroyed. Yes. Go by go. Uh, they've reduced the amount of um spells I have too, so I have to learn where I've placed everything now. All my main spells are all on the bottom here, so that's that's not too bad. Keeps jumping around for some reason. Smashed. Uh, one more. <laughs> Sweet. What else do I need to do? Oh, these aren't the right guys. That would be why. So dead. Um, let's get this guy out again. I like this because although it's not technically it's not hard to get, it's uh, a chance drop, so it's always um, always fun to fly around with this. But you know, most people have way more time than me to get all the fancy mounts that you can get now. So like this. Well, I think that's bought, but whatever hand that in I guess this is going to be a long campaign and that rings and still still not as good as the one I have so that can go over there um I don't know if I I was thinking about doing the uh, the upper black rock, rock spire but I don't know if I'll do that um, on here actually it's almost 15 minutes anyway so I'll probably leave it there so hopefully that's been interesting uh, a little little look at the new content for what well, the pre-launch for WoW 
um, if you're interested, in, um, go check out my MMO, The Art of MMOs video, um, and you will be able to see what it used to look like, at least with the characters. Um, obviously the environments haven't changed that much, but the characters definitely. Um, and like I said, I'll leave it there. So hopefully you had a good, um, what do we say, Wednesday? Wednesday. Hopefully you had a good Wednesday, and I'll talk to you again tomorrow. Alright, cheers guys.